I was the oldest of five, and uh, he knew he knew our teachers. And he knew uh, more than we wanted him to. He, he was really involved by getting a good education, you know, and making sure we was doing our homework and pushing us. But one of the things he would check me out of school to do would be this ham and egg show. And I think it being uh, my granddaddy was a sharecropper and, and curing hams and having the chickens around on, at their place, I think it was part of it. And he just, uh, he saw that going away and my dad always thought it was important to come support this show. And he'd, uh, he'd even let, let us check out of school and bring us down here. So I'm telling Mr. Pat, he's been here a long time, 30, 35 years, I know, because uh, I remember uh, as a young, young boy, uh, was Pat was uh, being auctioneered. So uh, anyway, appreciate everybody. I want to say a special thanks uh, to the to the buyers. Uh, this you know this show wouldn't continue if we didn't have folks buying these ham and eggs. Right. And I know we have a lot of buyers represented out here in the audience, and, and then some of you are representing buyers that actually couldn't be here that'll be purchasing hams and eggs. And, and uh, I'll tell you, everybody, we need to make sure we remember these names. And when you're in their place of business, we need to we need to acknowledge that because. Uh, you know, if we didn't have them buyers here today, buying these having eggs, we couldn't do this. So let's remember as we get out in the community to remember these folks that, that buy these having and eggs and, and try to remember to give them a thank you and a pat on the back and show our appreciation uh, to help keep this show going strong. <coughs> so once again, from Farm Bureau, thanks. Uh, we're proud to be a part of this. Uh, we're a proud sponsor and uh, hope we have a good sale today. Thank you all.